Hey, it's alone, family, this time. May the peace of y'all be with each and every one of you, brothers and sisters. We have all kinds of things going on in this world at this time, brothers and sisters. Yes, and we have many people, uh, they playing the game to get paid, brothers and sisters. Um, you need to understand these things, the thing you witness on TV, the, um, YouTube, and all these things of the religious um, leaders, our uh, brothers and sisters. You got to know they're playing a the game, and, and, and so many of our families are caught up in this game, brothers and sisters. They don't care nothing about you, brothers and sisters. Many people have said these things in the past and died and said, um, before they died. They left this message that they don't care for you, brothers and sisters. I'm not saying I'm going to die, but I'm going to tell you about the other people. And some people alive say these things, brothers and sisters, that witness the things and know the inner circle of the people, brothers and, and, and sisters. And many brothers that don't follow these people but teach the same doctrine that is Hebrew people, but don't know this teaching going on for thousands of years, brothers and, and, and sisters. These people use all kinds of hissing sounds and audible voices to captivate the minds of the people, brothers and sisters. As I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you, brothers and sisters, and they speak not the truth of Yah. And people say these people have have power. They have um, the spirit. And, and, and these things captivate our people for so long, brothers and, and, and sisters, the things they do. So I'm going to read this, the words of Isaiah 66 to you, starting in the 13th to the 24th verse at this time, brothers. So you'd hear the words of Yah in truth, brothers and sisters, because I come to tell you, uh, brothers and, and, and sisters, they play with your mind, with sounds. Yes, they got the best um, sound systems, uh, brothers and sisters, that um, money can buy. And they use all kinds of sounds to captivate you, brothers and sisters, at this time. You see what I'm saying unto you, brothers and sisters. And I come to here today to tell you, bring you the words of Yah, brothers and sisters. You know what I'm saying unto you? Do you truly understand what I'm saying unto you, brothers and sisters? And at this time, I bring this word to you, brothers and sisters, the end result of the people that play the games, brothers and sisters, and rob you of your money. And they play with the words of Yah, brothers and sisters, and lead many astray from him. I come to bring you this message today, that you may hear the words of Yah. And understand them and believe in them, brothers and sisters, at this time. That I bring this word to you, that you may believe the words of Yah at this time. In chapter 66 of Isaiah, I bring this word unto you. As one whom his mother comfort. So will I comfort you. And ye, which is you, shall be comforted. And Yah shalom. And when you see this, your heart shall be rejoicing. And your bones shall flourish like the herb. And the hands of Yah shall be known towards his servant and his indignation and his indignation towards his enemies. <laughs> For behold, Yah will come with fire and with the chariots like a whirlwind <laughs> to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with a flame of fire for by fire and by his sword will Yah plead with all flesh and the slain of Yah 
She'll be many brothers and sisters. And they that sanctify themselves and purify themselves in the garden behind the tree uh, in the mist. Yes, brothers and sisters, these are the ones who eat swine flesh. Brothers and sisters, I am talking to you today. These are the words of Yah that come to you from the mouth of Isaiah at this time. Brothers and sisters, hear the words of Yah, brothers and sisters. They eat the swine flesh and abominations and the mouse shall be consumed together, saith Yah. Don't you know, brothers and sisters, the words of Yah is true. And the ones you witness that um, playing these games, brothers and sisters, they all in the bed together, brothers and sisters. Don't you know that? The homosexual, brother. This is what God worship do. The Elohim worship do at the best before your eyes. From your own people, from the own Hebrew people, brothers and sisters. It doesn't matter. They done these things before, and that's why Abiyah had, had to expel them out of the land, brothers and sisters. These are the facts. They learned this crafty uh, speaking, this hissing, with deep audible voices, brothers and sisters, to deceive you. And people will be saying they're anointing. But just making an audible voice is not the anointing of Yah. You got to get that, brothers and sisters. Because people go, huh, and Yah said, see, they can use Yah's name and all of that things, brothers and sisters. It doesn't even matter when they're playing games. These people is racking up cash, they're making money. They're using the words of Yah, certain part of the words of Yah for their own benefits, like paying tithes and offering. They put on the greatest show on earth for you, brothers and sisters. That's what they do. They don't care for flip. Yes, yeah, sometimes when they, they sit in their meetings, they know if a member making a lot of money or not. They know sometimes they're going to have to pay people rent. But what is a thousand, two thousand, when they're getting ten thousand from you annually? Or sometimes within your lifetime of your whole uh, life of membership. And they only gave you two thousand out of the ten thousand. But they keep eight thousand of your money. Think about that, brother. Do the math. That make a lot of sense to them. These people go to college and some non-college people, and they get hooked up. So let me finish this message, brother. These are the true words I bring to you of y'all, brother. These are the facts. I'm not playing a game with you. I, you might hear me making them sounds, but it's the truth, brother and, and sister. This is what they how they do to captivate the minds of the people, to deceive you, to hoodwink you. They don't care a flip about you. That's why they don't care a flip of their own member they bring into the congregation. Homosexual, non homosexual. A lot of them are already homosexual. It's been, been known that choir members are homosexuals in, in these places, most of them. Yes, God is how they may sound, brothers and sisters. So let me keep on with this message. These words of Yah in chapter 17 Eat his swine flesh. The abominable things in the mouse shall be consumed together, saith Yah. For I know their works and their thoughts. It should come that I will gather all the nations and tongues, and they shall come and see my honor. See, I told you right there, brothers. I'll be I'll tell you right there through the mouth of Isaiah, Yahshua, Yah salvation. They I mean, I know they works. You know everything everyone on this earth is doing, brothers and sisters, at this time. In all times. Nothing get past y'all. Brothers and sisters. And many of our brothers is captivated by these things that they see. And they follow. They follow Christianity because I have these brothers and sisters. Still got one feet in and one feet out of Christianity, brothers and sisters. That's the truth. So they keep looking and seeing when the false preachers 
Go start saying something that is true. They always say something. If you follow that message, they always say one thing here or one thing there that is true. But in between all of that truth, 99% of it is falsehood. They always say something. If it's just one thing. That's how they hug Winky, brother and sister, with all that loud talk. All that sound effects they have. And they and, and, and they sit, do it with the best. I heard many of them. I went to many churches. I heard many preachers talk. I used to say that. Boy, he sound anointing. I was always trying to go to a place where they make that kind of noise. And he said that he will come for you. And he died for you to redeem you back to himself. See stuff like that, brothers. Anybody can do. Anybody can make that kind of noise. That's hissing noise. It's a loud, audible um, a noise you do with your breath. It's like you, you dig it. You like to take dig deep, and that's what they do. And then when you, when you, when you talk into a microphone, it amplifies your voice. And they can do all the kind of tweaking till they get the right sound, the perfect sound that people love. The only thing they got to get you to think in your mind. And play with your feelings, and you say it's anointing, and you start getting up everything you got. Yes, I heard people say, "Do these things, brothers and sisters." I believed in these things at one time, until I realized I could do it too. I can make the same sound. If I want to be a liar with it, I can be a liar with it. If I want to tell the truth with it, I can tell the truth with it. It depends on what spirit you have, brother and sister. That's all it is. But I don't play around with it. Brother and sister, I could do that, and I, I could do that, and, 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 and be captivating, and sound like the best of them. But I ain't do it in so long; it's hard for me to do it for too long. Like now, I was planning on doing it all the way through this whole message and read every scripture that way. But it's just not into me to do that no more, brother and sister, because I'm not gonna play nobody else. Brothers and sisters, and these are the true words of y'all, brothers. I'm giving you right now through these scriptures. Verse 18 He said, For I know their works and their thoughts, it shall come that I will gather all nations and tongues, and they shall come and see my honor. And I will set a sign among them, and I will send those that escape of them. See, he's gonna send those that escape from the places of captivity into the nation to Tarshish, Paul, Lud, and and draw the boat to Tubal and Javan, to the islands, which is the coastlands, and far off, that I have not heard, that they have not heard my fame. See, because everybody that time on here, but he said, he's going to make sure people go, that they may hear the fame of Yah. He said, neither have seen my honor, and they should declare my honor among the Gentiles, and they should bring all the, all your brethren for an offering unto Yah. See, see how people going to, Leave from Israel, the land of what they call Israel today, Israel, and go back and gather those who have not been picked up of the brethren and bring them back home so out of all the nations upon horses, see, and chariots, and in, in, in letters, litters, and upon mules, and upon swift beasts to my Gadesh mountain in Yashalom. You see, we're going back home, brothers and sisters. By all means necessary on that time. When this call gets sent out, we go back and those get sent out. You go and, and spread out your message to the nations, to the Gentiles that never heard of your voice. Never heard heard about all your greatness. Gonna go out to the nation. And our brothers that are still in these lands that is near or far gonna be bring, brung back to the land of God. See, we we not ain't nobody going, no church is coming to picking you up. From out of heaven. When well, Abiyah come back to earth. And then it's going to be time. When Abiyah send people out. And going to gather the rest. That have not been gathered. Brothers and sisters. These are the words of Yah. So let me keep reading. Before I close out. Say of Yah. As the children of Israel. Yah bring an offering. In a clean vessel. Into the house of Yah. You see that? In a clean vessel. And I will also take of them for priests and for Levites of Yah. For as the new heaven and the new moon which I will make shall remain before me, say of Yah, so shall your seed and your name remain. 
And it shall come to pass that from one new moon to another, and from one Sabbath to another, shall all flesh come to worship before me, saith Yah. And they shall go forth and look on the carcass of the men that have transgressed against me. See, that obeyed, disobeyed Yah. For their words shall not die, neither shall their fire be quenched. And they shall be a, a, hor a horroring unto all flesh. See, brothers and sisters, this is what reserved for the evil ones. These ones out here doing evil, wicked, all kinds of things. They're doing anything they want to do. And not obeying Yah in the family, not in the family. These are things that await them. So they playing all kinds of wicked games. Uh, for money and prestige and honor. Now. But that's not going to be always. Brother and, and sisters. You can mark that. You can check that. That is a fact. So that's why I don't waste my time. With these people. Y'all said. For us to stop honoring. And exalting men. All men. Pure, but only exalt our Yah. If our nation was right, our people wouldn't be exalting football players and basketball players and talking about football games and basketball games, or football season, it's basketball season. That's uh, any brother that do that for now, mock these brothers and sisters. Because you honor a man and you don't work the righteousness of Yah in, in, in the light to the nation of Yah or to the world. Because that's what the world do. That's their sports, that's their idolatry. Everything we should be doing is, is a light. For one, number one, we are the ones suffering more than anyone on the face of this earth. We should be playing the games that these people play. They playing the game for money. They don't give a flip. They don't give a flip about RBI. When they got a football game, they're going to play on Saturday. Whatever your seven may be, they're going to play on that date. They got a contract. They're going to kick somebody, but they're going to throw a ball in the air, tackle each other, all kind of homosexual. And then they're going to be all up in the church and they're going to be saying Jesus. You remember Deion Sanders used to do it all the time. He used to wear around his head, Jesus banner. But I wear Yah. But he had a false Messiah hanging around his head. And y'all know that's true. Brother and sister, see, this is what you do when you lift up these people's names, when you talk about sports. You play right in the hand of the one you can say you hate the most, your enemy that hates you the most. You don't hate them the most. You don't hate your enemy when you're walking around telling your brother about the football game you just watched. And how um, this guy ran up the field for 100 yards. How many people did that? 99 yards. It don't make a difference, brother. When you really get reality of the other thing, it's foolishness. Because, see, the ultimate, see, they play for higher stakes. Their biggest goal is to get a trophy and get carried off. They get the high they can in their field and get the money. They don't care how they get it, brothers and sisters. They do anything, they say anything. How many of these people out there proclaiming Yah? Think about that, brothers and sisters. Because how can you be claiming Yah and be going to work like I hear some brothers doing for Israelite herbs? Going to work on the Sabbath. These guys is fake, man. Some of them, not all of them, some of them sincere. And then they brags about it. See, that's what Zach exactly Wabia said. They will brag about sin. To, to get in somebody else's mind or heart that it's all right. If you're going to keep a Sabbath, keep the Sabbath. You don't let nobody break the Sabbath. And then you get the money. I see if you're doing something. But you weren't doing it for money and getting paid for it on the Sabbath. That it was something like an emergency, something you had to do. But these people going out here, they're going to a regular job because they're scared of their balls. They know that's their only income. But you're not standing up for y'all when you do that. You're going to stand up for up. You got to give up some things, brothers. That's why I tell you, you won't have to worry about none of these things if y'all brothers take up y'all for serious, get ready, come together. Not in an organization talking about coming together and somebody in that state and another person in another state. That's not no coming together. That's organizations coming together, but that is not the body coming together. That's exactly what all of y'all say right here. They that kodesh themselves, set apart themselves, and purify themselves. 
purifying themselves, one thing, you know, symbolic, uh, one thing that uh, symbolizes they, 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 they purify themselves is immersion in water. They say some man, they go, they're going into the water because this man died. They're coming out of the water because this man lived. And die for the sin. That's further from the truth. It ain't funny. It, it's not one scripture from the mouth of the prophet that Abiyah gave them that talks about death, brothers. Not one. Believe me, when I get an opportunity, I'm going to show you what's in 53 and who it's talking about. People that's doing this line don't have a clue who it's talking about because they lying. They still lying. Every week, what they call it, they keep their Sabbath. They, they come in lying and they go away lying. They go all over Facebook and YouTube. With more lies. That's no different than what T.D. Jake's doing with T Tyler Perry anointing him and he falling back. But some people like saying a frenzy, like he got a spirit, but he do got a spirit. He got the spirit of the devil in him, brothers and sisters. What they say, how can two walk together unless they agree? With that, I say shalom.